Oh, we didn't. Right. He said, um, I can be if you want me to be. This is Nathan, nice, you don't want to f with me. Watch out, Alan, So we've just been informed that we may not be welcome in here filming. Good morning, and welcome to Bridge End a place in the UK that you probably haven't heard of. A small market town just south of the famous Welsh Valleys, known for its rugged coastlines and also its extremely high rates of violent crime and arson. And seeing as we're in Wales, I don't speak Welsh, so I'm gonna need a little bit of assistance. So I've called upon my good friend, Curtis Price. Right, so in this video, we're gonna be taking you on a guided tour, not just of Bridge End, but of Neath, and also Swansea. Right, so give me a little description. What would you say Bridge End is like in one sentence? Absolute, total <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> Let's go and explore. I wanna to talk to a few of the locals as well, see what their opinion on Bridge End is. Because, you know, a lot of places, they've got a bad rep, but the people in the town, they actually do quite like it. But judging by this high street that I can see in the distance, I don't think they're gonna like it, to be honest. Yeah. Right, so I don't know about you, mate, but I am bloody starving. And I feel like the best way to scope out the real feel of a town is to go for a cheeky little Weatherspoons breakfast. Don't you agree? Yeah. Anybody? Let's that's go, it, mate. It's a police cabin, that's how unsafe it is. There's mate. A police cabin in the middle. It's so unsafe in Bridge End that they've got a permanent police van right in the center. Also, we've got home bargains at least. That's decent. Go get my one pound candles and all that, you know what I mean? Mate, literally everything is boarded up. How does any business survive here? It's just empty. That's quite motivational. Obesity kills, lose life. Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah feel, fair I'm enough. More, yeah. More yeah. Now. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's, that's got my day off to a good start. Nice little yeah. motivational quote there. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, you know when a betting shop is out of business, that's when you know an area is going to the pits, mate, honestly. And there's a bet thread as well. That's what I mean, look. The bonus king, the bonus loser. <laughs> <laughs> All police there in the distance already, already on their daily run, already patrolling. How mad is it's that? It's literally the morning time and they're already patrolling the town. Mental. Right, here we are. The Wyndham Arms Hotel. Off to get our lovely spoons brekkie. Mate, £2.25. I'm very excited. Can you believe it? Very excited. Can you believe it? Is that just Welsh prices or is that just Bridge M prices? Like. <laughs> Right, so here we are. We've got the £2.25 Weatherspoons breakfast. Can you believe it? Two hash brown, two egg, bacon, beans, tomato, mushrooms. Two quid 25, mate, you can't beat it. And also, in true Weatherspoons style, I've got the cheapest pint on the menu, £2.34, let's go. Hey, to be honest with you, you can't really complain at a Weatherspoons breakfast. Like, you get what you pay for, innit? Bloody lovely. Mate. Just cheap and cheerful, you know what I mean? Mate, what are you saying on that Weatherspoons breakfast? Bloody lovely, man. <laughs> <laughs> Spoken from a true Welshman himself. Well, that got absolutely slapped. Oh, mate, for once, I'm actually finished before you. I am. I roll. <laughs> and now, for the pint as well. Ah, oh, tastes like heaven, that does. Love goo. Oh no, love God. <laughs> My mistake. Right, what have we got up here? We've got some... A little bridge, I think. A bont, they call it. A bont, yeah? A bont. Yeah. Bont, or oh, gonna cross oh, the bont. Bon How do you say I'm gonna cross the bridge in Welsh? What do you mean, the carved or a bont? Ah, right, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna like attempt that. that. What do you reckon? Is that the brownest river you've ever seen? It's dirty, yeah, that's... that's like Thames level, isn't it? You know what, though? The one thing that I've noticed is there's quite a few pretty decent pubs around here. Do you know what I mean? It's like... How can you have such a nice looking gastro pub and then you've just got pure desolation on the high street? <laughs> Isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Rugby problem. Yeah, yeah. Knowing you lot. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we are, guys. We've stumbled across a shopping centre. How do you say it? The, the Rue Shopping Centre. The which, Rue. Yeah, in English, Rue means sex, or the sex shopping centre. The center, sex really. shopping centre. Yeah. My goodness, that's a bit naughty, isn't it? <laughs> let's, uh, let's go and have a little look inside and see if it's as bad as the high street. That's so, we've got a card factory. Nice. Just like every single shopping centre that exists. Uh, do you know what? Doesn't look as bad in here, really. Got a nice little cake shop. Oh, jewelries and gifts. Jewelries and gifts with no metal shutters. 
<laughs> that's a bit uh, that's a bit risky, don't you think, Randy? You've even got a game here. That's how you know. Oh, like mate, a game. I literally don't even know where game is in London or anywhere. I, I literally haven't seen a game in ages. Game in Swansea, oh my god, down. select. Have you seen them? Oh my god, the worst clothes shops to exist. Oh yeah, I mean it's uh, coming to the end of the shopping centre now. <laughs> not really, a, not really a shopping centre, I would say. Maybe just some shops. Right, so Curtis here has just told me that in Welsh. They don't use all the letters that English people use. No, it's not that we don't use them, they don't exist. They don't exist. No, they don't exist. They're just not yeah. in the vocabulary. Yeah, V, Z, X, those kind of letters don't exist. Right, instead we invented our own letters. Okay, for example, C-H. <laughs> and what's double L? <laughs> like a cat hissing. <laughs> yeah, we've got one F, which is a V, like the V like in English v. Oh, language. Okay. And then double F is a yeah. So and then we got two D's. V. <laughs> yeah. Oh, then we got R H, which is. R. Yeah. <laughs> Give me your your favourite sentence in Welsh. Go on. Okay. Um. With the beatings in eight, back and back. Go on. What does that mean? <laughs> what the hell oh. are you doing, boy? <laughs> so another thing that Bridgend is famous or maybe should I say notorious for. So from the years of 2006, 2007. Just loads of teenagers just randomly started uh, started committing suicide, and they put it down to a suicide pact. So yeah, that's what Bridgend is known for. Yeah, so no. you know what we're getting in for right now. Very weird contrast here. We've got a lovely, beautiful cocktail bar, yeah. and then literally just a rundown rugby sports clothing shop. Oh, the diversity of Bridgend. It's beautiful, isn't it? Looks like uh, yet another pub in the UK that has unfortunately closed down. Just like about 80 to 90% of them in the whole of the UK. Sad, really. This would have been absolutely packed and bustling at one point, but no more. Right, mate. I think this is the one. Yeah, it must be. The Phoenix, oh, mate. Are you mad? 270 a pint. Oh, that's me, mate. That's me all day. Doesn't look too bad in here, to be honest. Hello, you're right, mate. Uh, what's the cheapest pint you've got right We're now? You're gonna have Carlin. Carlin, two pound fifty. Should we get Carlin? Yeah. yeah. Can I get two Carlins, two please, pounds. mate? Thank you. Cheers, Cheers mate. mate. Cheers, buddy. Two pound fifty, mate. Mate, sweet little pint. Lovely little pub, as you can see there. Used to be a church, as you can see by the windows up there. Mm -hmm. Converted church. Not a bad idea. Do you know what? Don't look too bad in here, does it? No, it's got a boxer's machine as well. Oh, mate, boxing machine, we gotta do that. So the deal on here, Thursday, Thursdays, one ninety nine for a pint. One ninety nine for a pint, that is ridiculously cheap. Right, mate, yeah. what is your opinion of Bridge End so far? How are you liking it? Well, first things first, it's a dirty place. <laughs> right? A lot of dirty people hanging about. Um, saw someone walking on the street earlier with like some sort of chip pan in his hand or something. Did you see that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever that you call that. Uh, Pints are nice. This cathedral church pub is nice. When was the last time you came to Bridgend? Seven years ago. Has it changed a lot since then? Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <it's sh> <laughs> <laughs> Mate, I'm gonna start confessing in a minute. In the little confession booth here, bloody hell. Right, what do you reckon, mate? Right. Punch machine. I've never seen a punch machine where you can win AirPods or a Nando's gift card. Yeah, you going first? Yeah. Hey, look, 443 to win. Yeah, that you got. You easy. got to get. No, you got to get the exact number. You uh, can't get over or under. You got to get okay, the exact okay, number. Okay. Right. You going first? Yeah. No, no, you are. All right, go on then. Yeah, you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Take that. Oh, mate, I was five points off the AirPods. You're joking. Do a flying jump punch. Oi. Oi. Go on. Oh, it looks like I beat you, no, mate. Put one, put, put one more credit. <laughs> no, that's it. I win, mate. I win. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I beat you by two points. Bollocks, I'm mate. way stronger than you, mate. You, you're from Bridgend. Yeah, yeah. yeah? Don't Lived here all your life? Uh, yeah, yeah. Been here for five years. What would you say is uh, what's the general vibe in Bridgend? Dying. Rubbish. Dying. Yeah. Rubbish. <laughs> Used to be good ten years ago. Yeah. yeah. As you can see, all the time. I know. It's just completely it. boarded up. Literally, yeah. everything around here is just just desolate, yeah. man. Well, I was at one point. It was well, most pubs per square. Mile well, anywhere else in the UK. Oh, yeah. really? Was it, was it Cody's? 
Yeah, Cody's. Yeah, you had Cody's on the corner. Yeah. And that place, it was... 600 people. Oh, it was round. All as night. soon as... And Bridget used to be bouncing. As little as 10 years ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But na- nowadays... Same as when you notice when you go to Clonethley, Neath, they'd yeah. all die in. It's just the same same story as all the small sort of towns in the UK. They're all... Like, anywhere I go in the UK, it's, just, it's exactly yeah. the same, to be honest. Yeah. Cities win, don't they? Yeah, yeah. exactly. Great. Right, nice to meet you, lads. Nice one. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. Look at this, guys. I've been in Bridge End for two minutes, literally two minutes, and already someone's getting arrested. Look, two police cars. Oh, dearie me. Welcome to Bridge End. <laughs> Christ almighty, guys, have a look at this. We've got the London telephone boxes in Bridge End, let alone Bridge End. I didn't know that they had these outside of London. Are they open? That? Are they actually... Maybe. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh. oh, yeah, they actually do open. Oh, but they ain't got no... Uh... <laughs> We ain't got no phone inside. No. It's, uh, it's just for it's decoration. Been, oh, been look, ripped got out a nice black. little smashed window there. Very typical of Bridge End there. Yeah. Ah, bloody lovely, mate. Look, it's been ripped out of the... The phone has been ripped out of the wall, look. That is very Bridge End, is it yeah. not? 100%. Uh, Curtis, where are you taking me? Where, where are we going? Come on, Charles. I don't... On I, I, don't I don't... I don't trust this. I don't know. I don't know. Anybody fancy some milk? Because if you're not going to have it, I will. Right, mate. Yeah. Have you had enough of Bridge End? I've had a bloody enough chance. Yeah. No, enough I've had. Where should we go next? Neef? Castle <laughs> 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 Here we are, mate. The glorious town of Neef. Spoons? Spoons. Yeah, it's got to be spoons, innit? First point of contact. It's got to be. Suss the town out a little bit. Right, here we are. The David Prother Roman. David Man. No, David, like David Thomas. David Thomas. <laughs> 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 it looks alright in here, to be fair, mate. Hello, you're right. Uh, can, what's your cheapest pint of lager? Bud Light. Bud Light, yes. Can we get two Bud Lights, please? That is a great price. Mate, £4.50 for two pints. For one. Mate, four fifty. You'd be lucky to get a pint for four fifty in London. Are you mad? Yeah, man. Lovely. Thank you very much. Lovely. Thank you so much. Cheers. Cool. Look at that. That's gonna go down a treat, mate. So, uh, you got me. You got me. <laughs> right, let's have a little sip of this, shall we? Just like, just like... Oh, that very is nice, just... Is it? Yeah, yeah, do you want to be in the video? No way, what's so, happening, gang? we're going around Wales, right? And we're seeing what the worst, yeah, a, most deprived, dangerous yeah. towns are. <laughs> you came to yeah. me! What are you saying? What do you, what do you reckon about Neathan? What are you saying? Oh, it's, um... Uh, it's full of characters, it's, it's, yeah. it's like the Star Wars Are you from Neath? You're born and raised, Ted. Yeah, yeah. Born I'm, I'm on my feet myself. It's half thing, man. Right? <laughs> no, it's rough, yes, I'm yeah. It's fing dangerous. Rough. <laughs> I wouldn't say dangerous. Well, in the night time, I mean. Right. I mean, we, go that's outside. what makes it fun, eh? Yeah. You've got Abby around the corner. Yeah. You want to be outside, get your popcorn ready, you see plenty of fun. Yeah. Neath is a sh. Oh, but it's our sh. Yeah. Oh, she fancies you. Fuck you. Give me a break, does she fancy me? She does. Fuck you. I mean, I would. She's oh. not, she, you know, she's got good she taste. She likes older men. Yeah, she's got good taste, mate. Oh, Come on, don't, don't put yourself down. Come on, oh, you've got good taste. Yeah. Do you want to be on it? Yeah, if you don't mind. Yeah, right, questions. go on. What's your name? Uh, Pan. Pan? Yeah. How do you spell that? Like Sauce Pan. Oh, P A N. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Are you from Neath? Uh, Glenith, yeah. What do, you, uh, what do you think about Neath then? It's yeah? Cool. yeah? Yeah. Really? Complete dive? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Is it dangerous? Yeah, yeah, I'd say so. I, well, I'm you and I'm dangerous. So. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're the most dangerous character in, in Neath. Is that what you're saying? Well, not in them, Just up there. Well, Maybe well, not number one, but up there. Yes. Well, I'm up there, but I live in well, Glynneath. Oh, OK. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Yeah. We've got the second most dangerous woman. We don't TV. Oh, go on. Are we dangerous, right. he said. Um, I couldn't be if you want me to be. Oh. Are you ready for this? Go on. This is Neath and you don't want to f*** with me, <laughs> no, keep going. Looks pretty dangerous. I'm fing dumb. 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 I'm fing d
Well, mate, I'm not gonna lie. The people of Neef. Yeah, fantastic. Bloody Come lovely, on, mate. Yeah, loved it. Absolutely, absolutely brilliant, brilliant people. Absolutely brilliant. Shout out to all of those ladies that were uh, a, Come bit, a bit, a bit aggressive, <laughs> yeah. then nice, then aggressive and then aggressive again. again. Yeah. I don't know what we did, but uh, you yeah. know, I mean, I you bought, I bought a drink and everything, yeah, but you, still, we were hated yeah, for some reason. You can't start off by no. saying, "Oh, do you have misses?" And then flicking us off through the window. Yeah. And then back to, can I be in your video? Yeah. And then back to, and then hang on, I don't want to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like you want to be in it, and then you don't, and then you do. And it's yeah. like, come on, stop flip flopping. Right, I'm not going to lie to you, mate. I'm getting a little bit hungry. Right. So I need, I need some sustenance, but I want something that's traditional and Welsh. Right. right? Got you. What's a, what's a Welsh dish that is very famous, very traditional Welsh? I've got you. I've got you on this one. Go on. Cowl. 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 What is that? You love it, trust me. What is it? You love it. Yeah? All right, let's go get some cowl. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we are, mate. The Market Tavern. What do you reckon? You reckon they got cowl in there? Oh, they should do. If they yeah. don't, I'd be disappointed. I mean, it looks pretty yeah. pretty Welsh. Looks pretty like, traditional. Yeah, pretty Let's go and have a look. So, shall I ask for a plate of cowl or a bowl of cowl? Or a, bowl, bowl. a bowl. A bowl, yeah. bowl of cowl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have a bowl of cowl, please, man. <laughs> All right, mate. Can I just get one bowl of cowl, please? Oh, yeah. yeah, please. Thank you. Right, here we are, guys. We've got the cowl. It kind of just looks like a, like a beef stew. With vegetables and we got some uh, we got some bread as well. Right, let's try this. You said you didn't like this, no? You don't nah. like cow? It's all right. It's all right. No? Well, let's give this a go. Let's get some meat. Let's get some veg on this. Mmm. Mm. Oi. You're saying you don't like this? It's Mate, this is right. banging. It's not the best. It's all right. Mmm. Mate, you got the carrots. You got the onions. You got some. Is that spring onions as well? Yeah, yeah. You got some beef. You got some of these little pickled onions as well, mate. I'm not gonna lie. This is delicious. I would have that regularly. It's just like a beef stew, really. Mate, that's incredible. That's really nice. I'm not gonna lie. Big up to the Welsh, mate. Come on. Right, guys. That cowl was absolutely delicious. Right, we got 10 minutes to the train, so we need to leave right now. Right, next stop, Swansea. Let's go. Right, so our train is in nine minutes. We literally need to get a, a bit of a shift on. So, the next stop is Swansea, and we're going to the most dangerous street in all of Wales. All of Wales, woo! <laughs> what is your opinion of Neath, mate? It's all right, it's better than Bridgend, yeah. but... But few nutters about, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Few nutters. Not gonna lie, I loved it. Yeah, I genuinely nice. did. It was right, wasn't it? It's a lot nicer than I thought it'd be, to yeah, be honest. Decent, much better than Bridge End, anyway. Yeah. Jesus. Right, when's our train? Um, we've got seven minutes. Right, we're decent, we're decent, we got it. Right, here we are. Inglorious Swansea. Abertawe. Abertawe. Right, so in Swansea, there is a street called Wine Street, right? And this is literally the most dangerous street 
in Wales. It has the highest crime rate out of any particular street in Wales. And yeah. that's where we're going to go. Yeah. But not yet. We're going to go somewhere else first. Where, where, where are we going? To some, to where, some, just see some dodgy, dodgy estate, yeah? yeah. Some dodgy estate. Cool. Back to my roots. I absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. Right. So we're going to go to some dodgy estates, yeah, have a little pure. mingle, yeah. and then uh, and then we're going to go to Wine Street, finally. Yeah. We're going to end on the most dangerous, yeah? Yeah. That's yeah. It, yeah, yeah Sounds yeah. like a plan, but mate. So you know, we're going to see it late at night as well, because we'll yeah. be going there later tonight. Exactly. Seeing what it's like. The later there. it is, yeah, the more the active it's going to be, yeah, and uh, yeah. the more lively yeah, it's yeah, going to yeah, be, yeah? There'll be police everywhere. Yeah. There will be 100%. 100%. Yeah. Let's go. Music, That's the one, mate. So we've just been informed that we may not be welcome in here filming. Right, here we are, mate. Cheers. Shout out to Swansea. We love you, even though we're uh, getting a few eyeballs here because we got the camera out, but it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Oh, that is good. There's a brown girl in the ring. Tra -la 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 -la. <laughs> right, so we've had a couple of pints in the, uh, what's it called? The full moon. The full moon. What a great pub. Lovely characters in there. To be honest, lovely people. You see, when you see a pub that looks a bit rough and rugged on the outside, I feel like that's actually the pub that I want to go to the most. Yeah, I feel like you have it. the most genuine people in pubs like that. So yeah. fair play. Shout out to the full moon in Swansea. Absolutely great place. Right, mate. What do you reckon? Do you think we've warmed ourselves up now to go to the most dangerous street in Wales? Oh, I think so, Charles. It's pretty violent so? down there. You yeah. think so, yeah? Pretty, you pretty think we're ready? Yeah, it was I, think we're, I think we're moderately intoxicated to be able to uh, achieve such a feat as in to dare wander <laughs> the streets of Wine Street. Uh, Saturday, you think? Saturday, Saturday yeah? it's pretty violent. Let's go, yeah. let's go. Yeah. So here we are, the roughest street in the whole of Wales. Wine Street. Right, so here we are, mate. The notorious Wine Street. Let's go. Oh, it's buzzing, mate. Absolutely buzzing. Right, what are you thinking, mate? There's so many clubs and pubs. I just, yeah. I can't choose, mate. I don't know where I want to get my head kicked in tonight. Oh, no. It's the policeman. It's the Rosas. Mate, this place is a nightclub with a chip shop built into the side of it, mate. Bloody hell. I feel like we have to go in yeah, there yeah, now. On, Even if we don't get the fish and chips, I feel like we have to go in there. Yeah, yeah let's go, it. let's go. Ooh. That is cheap. Mate, 250 a pint. Let's go, buddy. 